all right guys you're welcome to my youtube channel it's your boy Ulushola david in today's video i'm going to be doing a quick review of the alley dropship premium dropshipping stuff as you already know dropshipping is a quick way to start making money online but if you have to start from scratch you're going to know the process is really daunting and time consuming which is why the alley dropship team has come up with a replica of their already successful dropshipping store. So instead of starting from scratch, all you have to do is scroll through the premium store and, and choose the one that resonates with what you want. Make a purchase, download the website, get your domain name and install it on your web hosting and start selling. If you don't want to go through the process of installing, you can equally pay for the installation package and them out for the website installed for you. You should also know that the premium stock comes with not selling products, so you don't have to do product research or whatsoever. Everything comes with odd selling products and also if you want them to run an advert for you or you want them to promote the store for you you can equally choose from their ready to use marketing package to skyrocket your store sales everything you need to be successful in this business is already made available with you all you have to do is just choose your own premium store and start selling the next thing to do now is to choose from their five current existing premium drop shipping store. You can either have an exact copy of the classic store that makes $500,000 per year or the gaming store with $18,000 in monthly revenue or the cutest store with clothing and accessories that make $12,000 per month or the amazing store with home improvement tools that is currently making $6,000 per month and finally the best store with all mess essential this store is currently making four thousand dollars per month so if you want any of this existing store you're going to get an exact copy of this premium drop shipping store all you have to do is just change the logo and do a little customization to suit your own needs as for me i'm going to be going with the gaming store with eighteen thousand dollars monthly revenue so all i have to do now is click on the learn month button and we're going to be redirected to the other page the current price for the premium dropshipping store is $300 which is a one-time offer so you don't have to pay any additional fee or any monthly fee once you pay your $300 you have access to everything that has to do with this store but if you want them to install the store for you like i said earlier if you don't want to go through the store uploading the store to your web hosting and doing all the technical stuff you can as well click the installation package and add it to your order also if you're going to be running advert for your store and you're not really game when it comes to facebook advert and instagram ads i would suggest you add a marketing package to your order and let the elite dropship team do the advert for you since they are already good at running advert this is going to be an additional bonus for you you can as well relax and watch your dropshipping store generate massive sales from the advert that is being run on your behalf so once you have done all you have to do is click the buy now button and you're going to be redirected to the other page where you can add your credit card details to make a purchase so once you are there all you have to do is enter your credit card details and i'm going to be adding a coupon code at the description of the video you can as well scroll down to check the coupon code and get a discount for yourself if you're going to be purchasing the premium dropshipping store so to get a discount all you have to do is come here and click on redeem it here so i've already purchased the store so i'm not going to buy again but in your own case once you've entered your credit card add your coupon code you're going to get a discount and once you've made the payment is going to be redirected to the thank you page where you can download the store and you're also going to be sent a thank you order email address telling you how to download and install the web store okay so after that what we have to do now is go and purchase a domain for your store if you have a domain already all you have to do is just point the name sarah to the web hosting 
account that you're going to be using to host the account so a good place to get a domain name is namecheap as you can see i already have a domain name for my store which is gamifyup.com okay so i'm going to if you're going to be using a different web hosting what you have to do is choose the custom dns and add the name server here okay so after that what we have to do is go to your c panel and what you want to do is go to my sql database once you click on the my sql database you're going to have to create a new database for yourself okay so in my case what i have to do now is create a new database for gamifyup.com okay so i'm simply going to paste it here so after that click on create database all right so the database has been created what i simply have to do is click on the go back button to create a new my sqll database user so what i have to do now is scroll down and from here you can see add new user so all i have to do is create a new user i click on the back button to add user to database so all you simply have to do here is click on the add button and it's going to add the user to the database okay so the next thing to do here is we're going to tick all privileges then scroll down then click on the make changes all right so everything has been done now so what we have to do now is to go back and upload the files okay so what you have to do now is you have to go to your c panel then go to your file manager okay so this is my file manager so in case you don't know how to go to your c panel all you simply have to do is go back home then click on the file manager here so i already have that open here so what you simply have to do here is go to the upload section and upload the file so the file you're going to upload is the file you downloaded from the thank you page earlier so in your case it's going to look like this so before you can upload this what you have to do is you have to extract all the files okay so you click on extract files and it's going to extract all the files Okay, so after it has been successfully extracted what you have to do is open the file but before you can upload it you're still going to do a little trick on it okay so after that click on the website archive so before you upload it you have to rename this with your own domain name okay so in my case what i have to do is copy my domain then rename it okay so i'm going to make this my domain name so after this what we have to do is go back to your cpanel then you can now upload the file okay so from here click on uploads click the select file So I'm going to give it a while to upload. So once it has uploaded successfully, the next thing you have to do is simply go to another browser and enter your domain name. So in my own case, it's going to be HTTPS slash my domain name. Then slash kick kickstart.php once you load your domain name.com slash kickstart.php this is what the akiba kickstart is going to welcome you with so in your own case what you have to do is simply click the down button to close the message and proceed as you can see this is what you're going to see you're going to see the select backup archive select an extraction method fine tune and the last one which is extract file okay so what you're going to do in your case just to make sure you spot your domain name as you can see this is my domain name and after you've seen your domain name here all you have to do is scroll to the bottom of the page and click on the extract file so in my case i'm going to click on the start extraction now so it's going to start extracting so i'm going to give it a while to load 
and after that we'll proceed to the next stage okay so the extraction process is complete the next thing we have to do now is click on the run installer okay so i'll simply click on the run the installer button and it's going to start installing after it has been installed your pre-installation check should look somewhat like this everything should be green and your recommended setting should look something like this so after everything is okay what you simply have to do is scroll up and click on the next button at this stage what we're going to need is the database information we created earlier so as you can see what you have to do here when it comes to the database server host simply put local host then for the username you have to go back to your database and get your the username you created for your database initially so let me simply copy my username here then my password After that you would want to check if your own settings is like this if your settings is like this then everything is okay so the next thing we have to do is scroll up again and click on the next button so after that give it a while and let the database restoration to complete the restoration process as you can see the database restoration was successful the next thing we have to do now is click on the next step at this stage you need to set your site parameters that is you need to give your site a name and create your wordpress admin details yeah so in my own case it's going to be gamify gamify hub then tagline you, you could give it anything so in my case let me simply put game accessories all right so wordpress address gamify up.com site address gamify up.com so you are done with this place what you simply have to do is scroll through the super user settings this is your wordpress admin settings so the wordpress admin username that you want to use is going to be here then the email address you want to receive your notification with okay so in my case let me put my email address here then set the password for it after that all you have to do is simply scroll up then click on the next button at this stage you don't really need to do anything all you have to do is just cross check if everything is like this then you are okay to proceed so in my case what i have to do again is click the next button then after that give it a while and let the replacement in progress complete the replacement process now everything is installed all i have to do now is simply close the page then go back to the previous page and click the clean up button so what i have to do now is close the page then come back here and click the clean up button so after it has been cleaned up what you simply have to do is click the visit your site front end to visit your store finally the store is ready and everything works perfectly fine so in your case your own store should also look something like this all right so as you can see everything works perfectly fine and this is equally my domain name and a facebook pixel is already installed on the website also so majority of the hard work is done for you all you have to do is start running promotion and start making money with your own premium dropshipping store but as you can see the work is not totally done the next thing you have to do now is simply log into your wordpress admin dashboard remember you create your wordpress admin details earlier so you're going to be logging in with the username you created then the password you create also so once you've logged in you can go to your wordpress admin area and activate all your plugins you can check the activation code from the thank you email that is sent to you after your successful payment these are the plugins as you can see we have add abandoned cards early dropship plugin we have the facebook business catalog plugin we have the early dropship enhanced e-commerce plugin then we have the early dropship plugin and we have yoast plugin 
So this is basically everything you need to install and purchase your Ali Dropship Premium Dropshipping store. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. And if you are here to subscribe to my YouTube channel, please do subscribe to the YouTube channel. And don't forget, I'm going to be adding a coupon at the description of the video. So scroll down to get a coupon and use it to get a discount on your purchase. So thank you for watching. I will see you on the next one.